this is Leonie V. Welcome back to my channel. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to make a no su tutu dress with crochet top. If you are looking for ideas in your upcoming birthday party, wedding, fairy costume, or a ballerina gown, you could do it yourself at home without sewing it. The crochet top, I use shell stitch and add some beads and the back side I put some ribbon on it so it looks more pretty you will need cotton yarn now this yarn I use 12 ply cotton yarn 4.50 millimeter crochet hook and pearl beads Let's start with a slip knot and chain 77. Round one, two double crochet into the fourth chain. Now, this is the half shell stitch. Skip two chains and single crochet into the third chain. Skip two chains and make five double crochet in the third chain. Skip two chains and single crochet in the third chain. Skip two chains and make five double crochet in the third chain. Continue the same sequence until the end of this round. Round 2. Turn your work and chain 3. 2 double crochet into the same space. Skip two stitches and single crochet into the third stitch. Now on the single crochet, make five double crochet on it. Skip two stitches and single crochet into the third stitch. On the single crochet, make five double crochet in it.
skip two stitches and single crochet into the third stitch on the single crochet make five double crochet in it continue the same sequence until the end of this round at the end of this round single crochet into the third chain round three turn your work chain three and make two double crochet in the same space skip two stitches and single crochet on the third stitch on the single crochet make five double crochet in it Now keep repeating this sequence each and every round until you have 20 rounds or your desired length. Now I have 20 rounds. The length is 21 centimeter. The width is 44 and a half centimeter. Now we're going to single crochet all around Now this is the back side where we attach our lace or the ribbon Now we're going to single crochet all the around on the chest side. and we will single crochet all around the back side
slip stitch and cut the yarn. Now inside of the blouse, we're going to make chains where we're going to attach the tool. Now we're going to start here on the first double crochet. Chain one and single crochet in the same space. Chain three and single crochet into the next shell stitch. Chain five. And single crochet into the next base of the shell stitch. Chain five and single crochet into the next base of the shell stitch. Now continue repeating until the end of this round. Now this is done. Now we're going to make the strap on the shoulder. I took only measurements instead of counting the stitches. That's more easy. From the back to sleeve is 14 and a half centimeter. Same on the other side. In the front, in the neckline is eight centimeter. This is the back. Now we'll start stitching the strap on the shoulder. Insert the hook and join the yarn. Chain one. and make eight single crochet. Now the next round, we're going to decrease the stitches. Now we're going to make 
single crochet together insert your hook in the same space and insert your hook in the next space and pull through three loops one single crochet each in four stitches now we're going to decrease the next two stitches the next round chain one single crochet in the same space and the rest of the stitches are all single crochet now continue repeating the same pattern until you have the length of 15 centimeter Now I have the length of 15 cm. We are going to increase one round. Chain one and make two single crochet in the same space. One single crochet each in four stitches. In the next stitch, you're going to make two single crochet. The next round will be all single crochet. Now this is finished, cut the yarn Make the same pattern on the other side of the sleeve Now the two sleeves are done now we're going to attach the sleeves at the back side.
now this is the back side and this is the inside this is the front next we're going to attach the tool now the size of this tool is the width is 15 centimeter and the length is 60 centimeter let's start from the three chains fold the tool into half and insert your tool under the chains Now insert the tail of the tool, pull it through, and tighten up. Now insert another one. Make sure that the tail of the tool is even and straight. Now the back side, we're going to put the lace or the ribbon. Now on the waistline, we're going to add some beads Join the yarn on the first three chains. Chain three and make two double crochet in the same space.
skip two stitches and single crochet on the third stitch. On the single crochet, we're going to make three double crochet. Grab one bead and chain one. Make three double crochet in the same space. Skip two stitches and single crochet on the third stitch. On the single crochet, make three double crochet, chain one with the bead and do three double crochet in the same space. Keep repeating this until you finish this round. Now we will add the beads around the neck, shoulder and the back. Join the yarn, chain one, and slip stitch in the same space. Grab one bead and chain one. Slip stitch on the next stitch. Grab one bead and chain one. Slip stitch on the next stitch. Grab one bead and chain one. Keep repeating this until you finish this round. Now we're going to add some stitch like a lace on the shoulder with beads. We we'll start from the first single crochet, insert the hook and join the yarn. Chain one and single crochet in the same space. Now skip one stitch and make three double crochet in the next stitch.
chain one with the bead and three double crochet in the same space Skip one stitch and single crochet in the next stitch. Skip one stitch and make three double crochet in the next stitch. Grab one bead and chain one. Make three double crochet in the same space. Now continue repeating this pattern until you finish this round. Hope it helped you and would also try making your own. If you are new to my channel, please click subscribe and hit the bell button down below so you will receive a notification whenever I will upload new video. Thank you for watching. Bye!